We've only got three weeks left. We're doing it in Wimbledon this week until right. Saturday, then Milton Keynes, then Nottingham. And it's very exciting this week because tomorrow night Eric Idle's coming to see the show. Oh, and I've oh. not met Eric. Have you met Eric before? No, I haven't. No, I'm very excited about that. That'll be yeah. better. Well, that's, you know, that's when you're obviously the original Monty Python boys. Yeah. Is that going to be a little bit scary, though? Yeah, we were discussing it last week because he wrote it. And, of you know, course, John Dupree yeah. wrote the music. John Dupree came last week and wrote all the music. Right. That was great. But to see Eric, he's coming with Brian Cox, Professor Brian Cox, right. who tomorrow night is playing God. Which is uh, is great because uh, you know it's a long involved, but we have different celebrity gods. Yes. And um, he's doing God tomorrow night, and I love Brian Cox's God. I've done it before with right. God in the West End with Brian, and he was brilliant. I think the fact that he's a scientist and he really gets into the part of God, he does. Well, brilliant. you would. Have you ever had any girl gods, or does it uh, yeah, always have to be have a chap? Uh, yeah, Barbara Windsor did God in the West oh, End. Yeah. Perfect. But yeah. we was in Glasgow last week, and yeah. you got because we use local references, yes. and you got a big mention, especially oh. because wherever we are, we we you use local references and with all your bikini shots last week oh yes you was on it like a badger <laughs> right without word of a lie right? you was on it like a badger you got the best best reaction all week last week was, was it rude I was no like no it's it. very okay. complimentary okay. Very, very, well, you, well, we, well, in the show it's a mickey take of everything but it's very complimentary and you was at the end of the show we have two local famous people and you was one of them <laughs> and because of the bikini shots you was right up there was, right you, up there you was badger Excellent. lady it was oh brilliant. i'm loving it yeah. i'm loving it it's it absolutely great. And I'm in it as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, yeah we yeah. should say actually that you're there in a, in a, a crucial part. I am there. I'm there a lot. We're there together all the time. But isn't it we? weird? Because you know, with being father and son, or do you just uh, you just can treat your dad like another actor? Is that I how you know, work it? I think, I think yeah, the think lines blur to. a bit. We, we, we're doing all right though, aren't we? I think if your dad comes to see you do anything, whatever you do, you get a bit nervous. Yes, but he is just there all of the time. So I have to sort of remember that I'm not doing it for him and I'm <laughs> doing it for the 900 people that have paid tickets. Indeed. Um, so, yeah, no, I think we're doing all right. We're, we're yeah. getting on. On the first day when we got to the, the dressing room, he said, um, do you want to call me Dad or Joe? And I was like, ah, I'll, I'll call you Dad. Dad that's, just, <laughs> yeah. that's pushing it a little bit. Because you're both Joe. Are you Big Joe and Little Joe? Well, in actual fact, my dad's Big Joe. He's old oh, Joe now, because my dad was yeah. Joe as well. Right. Well, he still is. He's still alive. Yeah, he's old Joe. <laughs> right. So I'm Big Joe and he's Little Joe now. But it used to be my dad was Big Joe and I was Little Joe. Right. And it's just gone down the line. And, and defeat us now. And if you have a baby, will you call your baby Joe? <laughs> Maybe, yeah. I think, well, yeah, if I have kids, I'm just going to call them all Dave. <laughs> Just, just, just to even draw a line. Girls? Even if they're girls, I'm just going to draw a line right that. under it. Oh, Stop it gosh. there. Cool. Lots of people know you, of course, from Hollyoaks. Yes. Um, that was a fantastic and groundbreaking storyline that you were involved in. It was it very was, good. Yeah, it was all right. That, the, sort of the last one I did was, you know, for the transgender community. Yeah, it was, it was really good. It was um, uh, uh, Madupe who played uh, my girlfriend in it. That was, she was, the, you know, the highest profile transgender yeah. character uh, on British telly at the time. Yeah, absolutely. And obviously that's all very current at the moment it with Caitlyn Jenner and it stuff. It was good the way that they did it. They just did it as two people falling in love. You know, and that was really great. important, yeah. particularly to me, because yeah. it was the first storyline I got that was, you know, sort of affecting people's lives. So Indeed. I really wanted to do it well yeah. and for real, as opposed to something that was uh, an exaggeration. No, absolutely. And, yeah, and, you know, I got to know Paris Lees and, and quite oh, a lot of the trans. She's Paris. really lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, I, we took it really seriously. It did all right. No, it's brilliant. It shows you you've, you've done all of that and now laughs with your dad. I know, it's great. <laughs> in 26 years, this is the most time we've ever spent together. It is, yeah. Not I like mean, just right now. No, we've not, done this before. Yeah. <laughs> but we do share flats as well on the road as well, which is nice, isn't it? He's naked all of the time. Oh, dear. <laughs> well, not all the time, but a lot of it. <laughs> most of the time. <laughs> a lot of it. Well, once imagined, never unimagined. <laughs> yeah, morning. Enjoy <laughs> breakfast. Thanks for that.